The director of Caritas Syria, Riyadh Sarji, calls the sanctions imposed on Syria unjust and describes them as stalling the humanitarian aid needed for the survival of those affected by the recent earthquakes. But Syria's ongoing call for international aid has not gone unnoticed by the Vatican. Uh, Pope Francis is uh, working for Syria day by day, hour by hours, and he promised to send to Syria a lot of support. And uh, they informed us that uh, they also uh, doing uh, their best in Vatican City to, uh, to relieve the sanctions on Syria. Caritas Syria is distributing food, clothes and water to survivors. Its volunteers continue to work on rescue efforts, but report that they do not have the required materials to do so due to sanctions. The aid they are currently receiving comes from the closest Caritas in Lebanon. We saw a lot of people using their own hands to remove some stones, uh, to uh, secure some people inside, uh, under the, the rubble because we, uh, we really need a lot of uh, equipment and we have uh, no spare parts for also for this equipment, for medical devices, uh, medical equipment and so on. Sarji describes the situation in Syria as a nightmare. Survivors must brave the winter cold and food shortages. Right now, Caritas Syria has 300 staff members and 150 volunteers, with 15 new arrivals from Lebanon. But they are hoping for more aid from the international community.